Governor Kelly says the 10 person church limit was to help fight the spread of the disease. This afternoon, she tweets, she is aware of the pain, but says churches, while sacred, do not define Canton's faith. She had a news conference this afternoon. After consulting with my chief counsel, this afternoon I have instructed him to file suit against the Legislative Coordinating Council in order to ensure that politics does not continue to hinder our ability to save Kansas lives. Health Director Lee Norman warned the state's actual case number is probably higher than the reported one since some people just stayed home with mild cases and didn't report. Kansas COVID-19 numbers rose again today. Meanwhile, many churches and synagogues have already suspended Holy Week services for Christians and temple services for Passover. And Health Director Norman says a new report for the CDC indicates the virus may be more contagious than first thought. If that indeed is how it spreads, to really have it go out like wildfire. And that's why we've been seeing it in uh, like the rehab center that's in wind out that you've read about in the press. And there is some uncertainty about whether or not this revocation also affects the other 10 person limit for other gatherings in Kansas. Lawyers have about a week to work on that. Meanwhile, the faithful in Kansas are dealing with uncertainty in the midst of one of the most reverent weeks of the year. Michael Mahoney, KMBC 9 News.